we're here. We've been waiting for this for a few months now and we're finally here. And I can't wait to go to the, uh, the sauna downstairs. And uh, this is just, look at this breathtaking view, I mean. This is the most relaxing getaway you could probably find within a few hour drive. We were really hoping for snow and we got lucky because it's supposed to dump another foot overnight. So we might just get snowed in. Nothing like a pool, jacuzzi, sauna, and snow. If you see my last episode, you already know. We're just getting slammed with snow in the passes right now. So it was a little bit of a longer drive as we were clearing the overpass. But nice and slow, not a lot of cars on the road, and uh, we're just excited to finally be here and hopefully I'll be able to record each room. Um, I know you're not allowed to record or take photos when there are people there, so I'm gonna try to get in after hours or before hours um, with permission, of course, and see if I can get you guys a little glimpse of each of the rooms. All right, sorry guys, I did not get you guys any video content today of the saunas but I have an opportunity tomorrow. That means I have to be there before it open, which is seven o'clock. I'm doing this for you guys. I do not want to wake up at six to record video of the saunas, but that's my only opportunity to actually show it to you guys. Uh, I'm gonna try to wake up at six, and if I do, you'll see these sauna rooms in the, in the video. Apparently there's some kind of winter storm that's about to hit Leavenworth and um, that's not going to be good if it does because we're expecting two inches of snow per hour and um, it's not supposed to stop snowing until like two days from now we'll see what happens if we totally get hit with the snow um, that'd be cool to wake up to but hopefully um, the conditions aren't horrible for when we uh, make it back um, over the past so we'll see what happens we're not going to sleep anytime soon. We're just gonna maybe watch something and chill. Um, actually, I'm heading to a, they have a really nice covered garage, so your car doesn't have to be all frozen in the morning. But, got some snacks. And just like that, it's another day. It's 6.45, so I may look. Yep. You can tell I'm not a morning person. Let's move on with the video. Look like I just woke up and that's because I did. Heading out or heading down to get those rooms for you guys. So there's obviously nobody here yet. And take a look at this place. In between sessions, there's this uh, quiet room. In between sessions, you can take the ice plunge, which is amazing. I gotta tell you, if you haven't tried it, you gotta get into it. You just gotta go from high heat to high cold. Favorite by far out of all the rooms is the herbal steam room, the eclipsis therapy room. Check this out.
like this is heaven on earth. This, this room is so bright. It smells so good. Well, right now it's not on yet, but it smells so good when it's on. And you got these little shower um, heads where you can just cool off and My original plan was to go back to sleep after I got this footage for you, but it's so incredible. I think I'm gonna go inside the pool and I'm gonna show you a little bit more on what outside looks like. It dumped, a, it dumped almost two feet of snow overnight and uh, I'm the only one here. It's still dumping snow. Changing cameras here. Um, I'm on my GoPro now. So lighting may be a little bit worse. Went back and changed because I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna go. I was gonna go back to sleep, but um, with how amazing uh, it is right now outside, nobody there. I'm gonna go show you a few more things with the GoPro because it's waterproof, and I'm shooting with the GoPro 10 and the DJI Osmo Pocket 2. I'm both great cameras for stuff like this. Um, it's not the best quality like your pro gear, but it gets the job done. Because there's so many people that come here, they just create a second space um, out next to here for seating area. So check this out, guys. What? What? Literally, it's just a I don't know if you can see this, but it's literally a foot and a half of snow, but this is the area I was talking about. I don't know if they're even gonna be able to open this. I mean, look at this. But this face right here, guys. I'm cold. That is cold. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna get one of the rooms. Come follow me into Winter Wonderland. Now this is the shot that everyone wants. So a lot of people put their camera right here or have their buddy right here and have you exiting this. It'd be weird if I did it. So I'm gonna maybe get a video of my wife, but she's sleeping. There's no way I'm gonna get her up right now this early, so. Show you this ice, this uh, cold water plunge. It, it hits you. breakfast in bed for my wife and I and we'll get the morning going then we'll hit the spa for a few hours get some lunch so I know up until this point all you've seen is me and you're like oh my wife and I oh and you, you probably think I'm doing this trip on myself but I'm not she's here she, she, she is here we just had we just had breakfast we're gonna go check out the I call it the candle shop because <laughs> I mean it's the gift shop uh, but all I see is candles there hmm? Hi there. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Get this a second, this one. Yeah. Go bigger, go home. Let's grab this one right here. They all smell the same. 
Okay, earlier in the video, it was still dark out. We're back after breakfast, and now you can see all the snow that I was talking about in the dark. We're gonna head up to the jacuzzi that's now open. So we're done with lunch and uh, we are, what are we gonna do? Pool. Probably gonna go back to the pool. I mean, uh, latest report is all passes are closed. Another 31 inches coming. So we're pretty much snowed in, like literally. Uh, we we're supposed to leave tomorrow morning, but I think uh, probably gonna end up crashing for another night since uh, car sleep doesn't really sound too great at this moment. last day here today just enjoying it the snow stopped and the sun came out blue sky so it's super pretty All right, it's checkout day. Had a great time out here. Um, one of the biggest things I hear all the time is, oh, it's too expensive. And here's what I want to say, is if you're looking at it just a standpoint of price, sure, it's expensive. It's like when we booked it, it was 5.15 a night before taxes. And then, um, I mean, now it's closer to 600, but if you're if you think about everything that you're getting so the sauna experience is something that you can't get anywhere else there's six different rooms the food for breakfast and lunch is included and you do get a evening bite plus a you know espresso coffee whatever you want um, as a drink so in terms of that it's actually very affordable um, and although prices are going up prices are going up on everything this vlog episode is done we are however not done here yet because the passes are still closed for another two days, which means we're gonna go to another hotel for a night or two or three. Um, hopefully it's just for a night, we'll see, but the goal is to head back to the back roads, which is about an eight hour drive. So um, that might not be fun, but at least we're all relaxed. If you're looking for a place where you can relax, unwind, and really refresh yourself, this is the place. We love it here. Um, this is going to be our annual trip. We don't know, probably winter time every single winter, um, just because of everything that you get, and quite incredible. And uh, really recommend it, and hope you guys get to experience this place as well.